all right you beautiful python developers welcome back so at the time of recording this video we are almost going to be reaching 20,000 subscribers so thank you so much for that and in the case of this video i'm going to be using this pycharm editor which i find very useful and very easy to use but feel free to use any editor you want and you can even use command prompt and for creating a GUI or graphical user interface, I'm going to be using the Kinter library, which is already inside Python. So you don't need to worry about installing any library. So first thing we need to do is add everything from Kinter to our Python program. So I'm just gonna write from Kinter. And again, you don't need to import anything or ins pip install anything. So I'm just gonna write from Kinter and we're gonna import everything that is inside this library just to make it a little bit easier. And then to create our window, we are just gonna create a variable of window and then we are gonna use this function or method that is inside Kinter. And what this will do is it will actually create our window and it will save this inside this variable of window. So whenever we refer to this window variable, you can think of our screen that contains a window. And then we need to add a geometry or a size of our application. So what we are going to do is we are going to write window dot geometry. And then inside this inside double quotes, we are going to tell it the width and the height of the window that we want. And that is very easy. So I'm going to give it a width of 300 pixels and then I'm going to put a small x. So I don't know why you don't need a multiplication sign, but a small x inside Kinter to specify that you're specifying width and height. So our width is 300 x and our height is 300. So feel free to change these values and play around with them. And then we need to add a title to our window. So I'm just going to write window dot title and inside brackets, we are going to give it a title. So I'm just going to call it first Kinter window. And then we just need to make sure that this window remains off the screen. So for example, if you run this program right now, it won't give you any errors, but the window won't appear on the screen. So I'm just going to write window. And then to make sure that it doesn't disappear from the screen, we are going to add a loop to it. So this will make sure that the window doesn't disappear from a screen because if we don't add this, the window will just appear very, very quickly and then disappear again. So let's run this program right now and see how it looks. So I'm just going to right click on it, click on run and uh, you'll be able to see that a window is over here. Now let's play around with the width and height a little bit. So let's say we want to change the height to 500 pixels. So let's reload it and see how it looks again. So you can see that the height of this window has increased. Now obviously you can add text inside this, add buttons and stuff like that. So if you want to learn how to do that, you can check out my music player Kinter playlist where we actually create a music player using this Kinter library. All right, guys, this was pretty much it for this video. And I hope this video inspired you a little bit to create your first GUI software. It can be anything that you want, anything that you're passionate about. And again, thank you for following me on this journey of creating videos on Build with Python. I hope I create to continue good content. Uh, yeah, and that's pretty much it. Peace out.